Hello students, welcome back. Let's have a look at the next question. The next question is draw a schematic diagram of a circuit consisting of a battery of 6 2 volt cells, a 6 ohm resistor and a 12 ohm resistor and an 18 ohm resistor and a plug key all connected in series. Calculate the following when the key is closed. Electric current flowing in the circuit, the potential difference across the 18 ohm resistor and the electrical power consumed in the 18 ohm resistor. Alright, so here we have a battery, a battery of 6 2 volt cells. That means there are 6 cells each having a potential difference of 2 volt. And then we have 3 resistors and a plug key all connected in series. So first we will draw the circuit diagram and then we will solve the following questions. So let's draw these 6 2 volt cells first. So here is the first cell, this is the second cell, this is the third cell, this is the fourth one, this is the fifth and this is the sixth. Children make a mistake of joining this positive and this negative together but that should not be done because in a cell the negative terminal of the first cell is connected to the positive of the second cell. The negative of the second is connected to the positive of the third and so on. Okay. So in this way the cells are connected. Now this is the positive terminal and this is the negative terminal. Each of these is having a value of 2 volt. Now there are three resistors. One is a 6 ohm resistor and another is a 12 ohm resistor and the third one is an 18 ohm resistor and it's given that they all are connected in series. So here we have drawn the three resistors in series and then there is a plug key. So here is the plug key and when it is closed current starts flowing in the circuit. So this should be a circuit diagram. Now we will find out the electric current flowing in the circuit. Now to find out the current flowing we need to find out the total resistance in the circuit and the total potential difference in the circuit. Now the po total potential difference in the circuit will be the 6 cells each having a value of 2 volt. So the total potential difference in the circuit is 12 volt. So V is 12 volt. Then we have the resistance. Let's find out the resistance. Now the resistors are in series. So the equivalent resistance when the resistors are connected in series is given by the addition of the individual resistors that is R1 plus R2 plus R3. So here the value of R1, R2, R3 are 6 plus 12 plus 18 which is 36. So the equivalent resistance of the circuit is 36 ohm. Alright, so here we have the equivalent resistance of the circuit. Here we have the potential difference of the entire circuit. Now to find out the current flowing we will be using Ohm's law that is V is equal to IR. So current will be given by V by R which is 12 by 36 which is 1 by 3 ampere. So our current in the circuit is 1 by 3 ampere. So this is your first answer. The second bit asks the potential difference across the 18 ohm resistor. Now students the current flowing in the entire circuit will be 1 by 3 ampere. Why? Because it is a series circuit. All the resistors are connected in series. So the same amount of current will flow in the entire circuit that is 1 by 3 ampere. But the potential difference across each resistor will be different in a series circuit. So we need to find out the potential difference across the 18 ohm resistor. Again we will apply the ohm's law to find out that V is equal to IR. The current in the circuit is 1 by 3 multiplied by the resistance across the 18 ohm resistor. So I write here 18 which is 6 volt. So this implies the potential difference across the 18 ohm resistor is 6 volt. So this is the answer to the second bit. Now the third bit asks the power consumed in the 18 ohm resistor. Now we know the formula for power is given by power is equal to voltage into current. So the value of voltage here is 6 volt we just found out now and the current is 1 by 3 ampere so it is 2. So the power consumed in the 18 ohm resistor is 2 watt. These are the answers to this question that the current flowing in the circuit is 1 by 3 ampere or 0 0.33 ampere. The potential difference across the 18 ohm resistor is 6 volt and the power consumed in the 18 ohm resistor is 2 watt. 
so this should be your answer so i hope you have understood it if this video was helpful to you please like it share it and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching bye bye please watch the playlist containing the solved physics questions and numericals from the previous years board exams i have shared the link of the playlist in the description box it will be very helpful to you while preparing for your exams